Hi everyone, welcome back to another movie reaction. Today we're gonna be watching Pride and Prejudice, which is a Patreon request from our Patreon Mr. Videotape. Thank you so much for requesting this movie and sponsoring this video. So today we have a drama romance movie, which is kind of new for this channel. We did before drama and then we did, uh, I don't know, Forrest Gump. It, it is drama, but I don't know if it is considered romance or not, but I really liked the romance story. It was tragic, kind of, but it was still very very good. So for today's movie I know nothing about it, I know only the title, I know that this movie exists but I still didn't watch it, I didn't even watch trailers or anything, I know the actors, the actress also, she's so famous, I forgot her name but I, I know her pretty well and also uh, I didn't read any story of it and anything at all, so we're going fully blind with this movie. So before we start guys make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel and also don't forget to turn the notification bell on. If you can also check out Patreon for the early and full reactions. And now let's start watching Pride and Prejudice. The sound of the birds is so calming. Nice song. You know, I play the piano, so the piano really touches me from deep inside. It's really awesome. I love this start. The start of the movie always matters. Seems like she's reading a novel or something. Is she living here? Lizzie! Lizzie, what have I told you about listening at the door? Mm. Never mind that, there's a Mr. Bingley right That is a bad habit. How do you know compassion for my poor nerves? Oh, you mistake me, my dear. I have the highest respect for them. They've been my constant companions. These <laughs> so, this is a family. Are those all sisters? They're so excited. They'd be so disappointed if he's not handsome. <laughs> I don't know why at the beginning I felt like this is an orphanage, but it seems like no. They're all sisters and the parents. This is the ball. Do these kind of parties exist still to this day or not? Because I really like them. Wish I could attend one of them one day. He's here. Okay, he's handsome from behind. He's handsome indeed. My type. <laughs> oh, he's really my type. Especially with that outfit. Oh my god, it's so sexy. I love this outfit so much. And they resume dancing. <laughs> His mood. <laughs> really my type. Introduction time? Whoa, too soon. Mr. Bingley. My eldest daughter, you know, Elizabeth and Miss Mary Ben. And may I introduce Mr. Darcy of Pemberley in Derbyshire. Why do I feel like his sister is kind of trouble? Like, she's going to be a troublesome in the future. And, and I'm not suggesting you can't read out of doors, of course. <laughs> Did she get his attention, the blonde one? Jane's dancing with Mr. Bingley. <laughs> he likes her. This guy is handsome too. But this one is certainly my type. She is the most beautiful creature I have ever beheld. You'd better return to your partner and enjoy her smiles. You're wasting your time with me. He seems depressed. I don't know why. Seems like he really doesn't belong here. <laughs> He's not enjoying his time. Mr. Darcy, wasn't it? It's like he's about to cry. <laughs> this dance kind of gave me motion sickness i have motion sickness i get it easily so now everyone's moving and it's really bothering me <laughs> oh my god they're jumping too much he's coming she certainly got his attention am i right it is a pity she's not more handsome can you say handsome to the girls i have no idea i thought the poetry was the food of love of a fine stout love it may but if it is only a vague inclination, I'm convinced one poor sonnet will kill it stone dead. So what do you recommend? Dancing. Even if one's partner is barely tolerable. Oh. She got out. This is gonna be an interesting uh, love story. I wonder how are they gonna meet again? Maybe through his friend and her sister? I don't know. But it's gonna be really interesting. It is a shame she's not more handsome. There's a really, can you say handsome to a lady? 
It is so weird. She has invited me to dine with her. Her brother will be dining out. Why? Oops, she got the, the cold. Do not hear of me returning home until I am back. She got sick. Well, do not die of cold. Sometimes they do die of cold. So high class. Miss Elizabeth Bennet. <laughs> She's here. <laughs> this is awkward. He likes her. She's in far better comfort here than she would have been at home. It's a pleasure. This guy is I mean, so sweet. Sorry, not a pleasure that she's ill, of course not. <laughs> a pleasure that she's here. <laughs> he likes her so much. That's good. <laughs> what was she expecting? <laughs> So this lady, this one, okay, I thought she's his sister first, but it seems like she's the, this guy's sister, right? Depending on the hair color. <laughs> My good opinion, once lost, is lost forever. He's charming. Oh dear, I cannot tease you about that. What a shame, for I dearly love to laugh. This is awkward again. <laughs> oh no, why are they here? They might ruin everything, you know. Not at all. Pleasure is all mine. I like the way they greet each other. So elegant. Mr. Collins at your service. Mr. Collins. What a superbly featured room and what excellent boiled potatoes. They're eating potatoes. <laughs> Seriously, are those potatoes? Really like the accent. The eldest. Miss Bennet is very soon to be engaged. Yeah, exactly. That's going to be engaged. Her in both age and beauty would make anyone an excellent partner. Indeed. Very agreeable alternative. I don't like him. I don't know why. <laughs> He's kind of weird. <laughs> oh, Mr. Wickham, how perfect you are. He's really perfect. I like his hair. Allow me to oblige. Oh, no, Mr. Wickham, please. What? A musician? <laughs> Be sure to invite Mr. Wickham. He is a credit to his profession. You can't invite He's him gonna be him. jealous. Oh, he's already jealous. <laughs> Oops. Or maybe there's something between them. Forgive me, but are you acquainted with him? Seems like it. With Mr. Darcy. I've been connected with his family since infancy. Oh, what happened? If he wishes to avoid seeing me, he must go. Not I. Oh. My father managed his estate. Okay. We grew up together, Darcy and I. His father treated me like a second son. We were both with him the day he died. <gasps> but Darcy ignored his wishes and gave the living to another man. Jealousy. Really? Well, he loved me better and Darcy couldn't stand it. <gasps> oh my How god. So there must be another reason other than jealousy? I don't believe it. Oh, she's never gonna love uh, Mr. Darcy? I'm still having a hard time with names. I still think there must have been a misunderstanding. How could Mr. Darcy do such a thing? Yeah, I think the same. I feel like something interesting is gonna happen at the ball tonight. <laughs> These are the brother and sister, Mr. Bingley, Miss Bingley. They're well dressed up tonight, better than the previous time. Even her hair today is so cool. <gasps> He's behind you! Oh, <laughs> he disappeared. Maybe he didn't see her. He didn't recognize her from behind. So far, she really likes Mr. Wickham. I feel like the names are too hard to memorize. <laughs> I'll get used to it. Mr. Collins. I don't like Mr. Collins again. <laughs> I did not think you danced, Mr. Collins. Several people, with her ladyship included, have complimented me on my lightness of foot. Oh, but you're not her type. Again with the movement. <laughs> It's making me dizzy, I don't know why. Again with the jumping. It's really triggering my motion sickness. It's my intention, if I may be so bold, to remain close to you throughout the evening. Oh no. May I have the next dance, Miss Elizabeth? You may. He's gonna dance. <laughs> Did I just agree to dance with Mr. Darcy? I dare say you will find him very amiable, is he? It would be most inconvenient since I just want to know him for all eternity. <laughs> <laughs> That's ironic. He's still holding the charming look on his face. 
less jumping this time, thank god. They don't need to discuss stuff while they're dancing. So, he knows how to dance. That's cool. No, I prefer to be unsociable and taciturn. That's kind of what I was saying also. I hear such different accounts of you as puzzle me exceedingly. She should listen to his side of the story. This is wrong. Maybe that guy is lying or half lying. You, you never know. She really loathes him. That's bad. Boy well, likes her. Very dear. You've delighted us long enough. <laughs> and the other young ladies have a turn. She got so much passion for playing the piano and singing. What's up, Mary? Why are you crying? <laughs> Poor Mary. She's kind of emo. Why are you hiding? Charles, you cannot be serious. Why? Why? Raw egg? I think I'd never be able to eat or drink <laughs> as she's doing raw eggs. I was hoping if it would not trouble you that I might solicit a private audience with Miss Elizabeth in the course of the morning. Everyone out. She should ask her first. Oh, come on. Now? Seriously? Jane. 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 He should take her somewhere. Not all of them go out for them. <laughs> That's so wrong. She doesn't like him at all. <laughs> Her face. <laughs> it's like she's gonna throw up. But he's polite, we gotta say. And that no reproach on the subject of fortune will cross my lips once we're married. You are too hasty, sir. You forget that I have given no answer. I must add that Lady Catherine will thoroughly approve when I speak to her of he's your modesty. He's so pushy. Economy. He's not listening. Creepy. Please understand me. I cannot accept you. Yeah, please. Mary likes him? Oh, if he could notice. Yeah, run away, girl. Run as far as you can. <laughs> He's understanding. Don't talk to her. Leave her alone. Wow, I love the lake. So beautiful. It's like a painted picture. Papa, please. You will have this house. I can't marry you. Please, Papa. I will never see you again if you do. <laughs> Get out of here, mother. Leave her alone. What's up? Jane. <gasps> what happened? Where are they going? Are they moving to another place? Don't tell me he's gonna marry someone else. <gasps> no, what's going on? They left. No, where did they go? <gasps> Read it, I don't mind. Please read it for us. It's far more likely that he does not love me and never has. He loves you, Jane. Do not give up. Yeah, he clearly loves her. Oh no, this is making me dizzy. No, stop. I've come here to tell you the news. What's up? Mr. Collins and I are engaged. She's forcing herself. I'm 27 years old. She's still so young. But I think not at that time. You deserve better, girl. <laughs> He's awkward. <laughs> Is Lizzie also 27 or younger? Oh, stop moving around. Oh, God. <sighs> My true suffering. I'm just gonna have to look away. Ah. Uh. Oh my God, stop moving the camera around. Is it this time she's visiting? That's Charlotte. Yeah. It seems like oh, yes, she's happy with her life. Any young lady would be happy to be the mistress of such a house. Oh, come on, dude. We're gonna meet Lady Catherine. One of the most extraordinary sights Wow! I wanna live there. Wow, I wanna live there. So beautiful. <laughs> I love castles. <gasps> What's he doing here? Mr. Darcy? Mr. Darcy? What are you doing here? You know my nephew. Nephew? Oh, they're gonna Mr. have Collins, dinner. You can't sit next to your wife. Move. Over there. Why? Is it a tradition? Maybe so he could, like, see his wife in front of him eating. <laughs> Beside him, he cannot see her, but in front of him, that's possible. Sisters, do they draw? Not one. 
It's very strange. But one of them plays the piano. I suppose we had no opportunity. What? Come, Miss Bennett, and play for us. No, I beg you. Her ladyship demands it. She doesn't know how to play. <laughs> I don't like her. That's she playing poorly. That's pretty good. In all your <laughs> She's messing up a bit. I do not have the talent of conversing easily with people I have never met before. That's also me. I understand him very well. I don't even smile in social events. Just like him. I totally get him. It's really tough and the toughest thing in the world to socialize with, with people that you don't know. It's a huge nightmare. I really wish I was a social person. This is a charming house. I believe my aunt did a great deal to it when Mr. Collins first arrived. He's trying to make a conversation. <laughs> That's adorable. Good day, Miss Elizabeth. It's been a pleasure. <laughs> He's more precious now. He's so precious. He's trying to change himself. One moment, guys. I think one of my cats is calling. I'm gonna get him in. So guys, I'm back. I took a small break and let my cats in. I have three cats, I mentioned before. And uh, I did... I made some coffee because this movie really, really needs some coffee because it is so good so far. And uh, yep, this is my coffee. So good. I have coffee addiction, guys. Like, I really can't, can't live without it. <laughs> I like it too concentrated and without sugar. Perfect. Black also. So, where did we stop? Let's see. He saved the man from an imprudent marriage. Who was the man? <coughs> His closest friend. Did Mr. Darcy give a reason for this interference? I think it was a family that was considered unsuitable. What? <gasps> so he separated them? I believe so. That's so shocking. Oh my god. He must have his reasons. I don't know. There's something in my eye. <laughs> Maybe an eyelash. I don't understand. I love you. <gasps> what? Most ardent. So direct. Please do me the honor of accepting my hand. Hmm? Do you think that anything might tempt me to accept the man who has ruined, perhaps forever, the happiness of a most beloved sister? I think he didn't do it. How could he do that? Forgive me. Oh no. His fortunes have been very great indeed. I like his eyes. You were the last man in the world I could ever be prevailed upon to marry. Honestly, I don't see a future for them <laughs> at this point. Are they gonna kiss? Forgive me. No kissing. He's hurt. She's not listening to his side of these stories. I'm sure he's not that bad. Maybe now she's gonna realize that she likes him? I think she's not gonna rest until she talks to him again. She stood there until evening or night? I don't know. Seriously? <laughs> no. Seriously? She's definitely imagining. No? I came to leave you this. He's really here. At which point he declared passionate love for my sister, whom he tried to persuade to elope with him. She is to inherit 30,000 pounds. Oh. That she guy's really bad. Oh my god. Are you alright? I hardly know. Oh, she's crying. I knew he got another side of these stories. Lizzie, we shall have no peace until she goes. Please. Is that really all you They care should about? not control their daughters' lives. Hmm? But I understand how life you was back mystery. then. How's she gonna meet with them again? So beautiful. That is a dream, isn't it? But so beautiful. I love the background music of this movie. So dreamy. It's not a dream? <laughs> he won't be there anyway. These great men are never at home. Oh, he's definitely gonna be there. I can feel it. But she doesn't want to meet him. I think that's wrong. She should meet him and talk to him. Wow. So beautiful. Keep up. It is really charming. I don't blame her. What kind of room is this? It's like a museum. Mr. Darcy. 
Oh, I had a feeling. <laughs> Do you not think him a handsome man? Maybe? He's so handsome. He's my type. He's so precious also. <laughs> oh, she fell in love with him really hard. I feel like he's gonna appear in front of her. <laughs> You'll see. Oh my god, so cool. I'd do anything to have this view. I do have lake views and stuff from my home, but still, this one is much better. <laughs> Don't tell me he's, he can play the piano, or maybe his sister. His sister, right? <laughs> he's here. <laughs> Embarrassing. I can tell from his face that he's a really good guy. <laughs> May I see you back to the village? No. Why? Why, girl? Why, Mr. Darcy? Oh, come on. You're in love with him. I hope he followed her. <laughs> he's here again? Maybe he's asking about her. He's asked us to dine with him tomorrow. He was very civil, wasn't yes. he? <laughs> She's talented. His sister is blonde. But he's not. They're My here. Sister, it's Georgiana. My brother has told me so much about you. I feel as if we are friends. He did? Thank <laughs> you. Unfortunate brother once had to put up with my playing for a whole evening. But he says you play so well. Then he has perjured himself most profoundly. <laughs> no, I said played quite He's finally smiling. <laughs> His sister is so beautiful, like an angel. Especially that she's wearing white. I love the accent. Wish I could talk like that. <laughs> What's going on? Lydia has run away. Oh. With Mr. Wickham. Oh no, bad news. Will his, her sister really be gone forever? Lost forever? I will leave you, goodbye. What? Help her. This is a dangerous road. You're all ruined. Who will take you now with a fallen? No! Oh, Lydia. We found them. They married. I can't make out his oh, me. Good thing he found her. Ring the bell, Kitty. <laughs> she can't get up now? Is that really all you think about? When you have five daughters, Lizzie, tell me what else will occupy That is wrong. And then perhaps you will understand. No, 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 that is wrong. This guy is wicked. I want to hear every little detail, mm. Lydia, dear. She forgave her. Mr. Darcy was at your wedding. He paid for the wedding. Wickham's commission. Everything. Is that it? I think that's a good thing. Married women never have much time for writing. Mm -hmm. I dare say you <laughs> This guy is awful. I had a feeling from the start. Mr. Bingley is returning to Netherfield. Mr. Bingley? <gasps> Mr. Bingley. I believe he's alone. His sister remains in town. Okay, that's better. <laughs> Jenny will see him. He's here. He's here. He's at the door. What? Everybody behave naturally. Whatever <laughs> you do, do not appear overbearing. Yeah, please. Mr. Darcy? The very instrument <laughs> of it. What does he think of coming here? He should have a seizure. I'm sure I shall. <laughs> I've heard about this trick to make the cheeks more reddish. <laughs> I should try it out. <laughs> Look how they're sitting now. Both of them are looking so handsome today. Oh, very Especially Mr. Darcy. Oh my god, he's really my type. I return to town tomorrow. No. So soon. Why? Well, we must be going, I think. <sighs> this movie is so painful <laughs> to watch <laughs> because none of the love stories is happening. It's always a disaster, isn't it? Um, yeah, it is. <laughs> a huge disaster. Oh my god, I love the nature. So charming. Where did they shoot this movie? I gotta check. I gotta go there for a vacation. I'm sorry though that he came with Mr. Darcy. Don't say that. Why ever not? Because she's in love with Mr. Darcy. Been so blind. Yeah, you you were. I'd like to request the privilege of speaking to Miss Bennett. Finally. Alone. Finally. Come oh, on, Bingley. mother. It's so good to see you again so soon. Don't look so desperate. <laughs> this is embarrassing. I really like this guy also. 
He's so sweet. He's down on his knees. Oh, wow. Leave them alone. <laughs> this family is a mess. <laughs> yes. Can we celebrate? He's so sweet. <laughs> are there men like this in real life? Where are they? Where are they hiding? <laughs> I like both of them, like this man got his own charm and also that man, he's so sweet and got his own charm. Both of them are my type. <laughs> but this guy is sexy, we can't deny it. So when are they gonna finally get together? I really can't wait. The movie is almost over, right? <gasps> Maybe they will not end up together. Can, can you die of happiness? <laughs> Sometimes, yeah. There was such another man for you. Perhaps Mr. Collins has a cousin. <laughs> <laughs> Please no. <laughs> they got a dog. I didn't see it before. Lady Catherine? What's she doing here? Oh, this isn't good. I need to speak to Miss Elizabeth Bennett alone. As a matter of urgency. Why? Huh? A report of a most alarming nature has reached me. That you intend to be united with my nephew, Mr. Darcy. What? Mr. Darcy is engaged to my daughter. What? Now what have you to say? Do you think it can be prevented by a young woman of inferior birth whose own sister's elopement resulted in a scandalously patched up marriage only achieved at the expense of your uncle? Bitch! I knew this lady is bad. Since I saw her, I hated her. Will you promise never to enter into such an engagement? I will not, and I certainly never shall. I'll ask you to leave immediately. Yeah, leave, bitch. Get out! <sighs> Poor Lizzie. She should fight for him. Get your man. I really hope she doesn't give up on him. Please, Lizzie. I'm so worried. Because the movie is about to end. And they still didn't get together. <laughs> Please, no. I'm more of a fan of happy romance. With some struggling at the beginning, but then it should end, happily end. Please tell me she's imagining because there's no way they're meeting so often. She's not imagining. No, no, please tell me she is because this is so unrealistic. <laughs> He's really here? I love the music. Oh my God, so beautiful. He's really here. If your feelings are still what they were last April, tell me so at once. No, she changed the... Please, please, don't mess up. <laughs> please don't mess up. However, your feelings have changed. I love you. Oh. I never wish to be parted from you from this day on. Please say yes. <gasps> Is that a yes? <laughs> My hands are cold. Warm them. Warm them for him. Yay! This is not a dream, right? <laughs> Please don't turn out to be a dream. It's not a dream. Yay! It's happening! I thought you hated the man. <laughs> no, Papa. It was a misunderstanding. You don't know him, Papa, if I told you what he was really like. What he's done. Tell him. Tell him everything. He and I are so similar. Really? <laughs> We've been so stubborn. I don't think it is a good match if both of the partners are stubborn. That would make a lot of arguments, fightings. <laughs> what a great father. I like him more than the mother. I feel like he cares more about his daughters than uh, the mom. If any young men come for Mary or Kitty, for heaven's sake, send them in. I'm quite at my leisure. <laughs> That's the ending? Are you kidding me? I can't believe this is the ending. I feel like it's not satisfying enough. So they got together, but we did not see them together, like officially together. I don't know. I feel like I'm not satisfied enough with the ending, but the movie is so freaking good. I loved it so much and it is so entertaining. And the men are so charming in it, especially Mr. Darcy. As I've mentioned, he's my type. He's so gorgeous. He's so precious also. But I'm still bothered by the ending. I want 
I want to see more. You know what I'm saying? After they got together, is there a second movie of this? I don't think so. But as I've mentioned, I really loved the movie and enjoyed my time today so much. I think my favorite uh, part of the movie was when, um, yeah, when her younger sister uh, ran away. This moment was like, I don't know how to describe it, like thrilling moment in the movie and uh, like uh, making it more exciting to watch. And also um, another favorite part of the movie, when Mr. Bingley proposed to Jane, it was a very, very awesome moment. I think the story of these two was more satisfying than the story of Darcy and Lizzie but still I loved both of them again thank you so much Mr. Videotape for giving me the opportunity to watch this movie and be able to react to it thank you so much again and I really hope you guys enjoyed watching this movie along with me thank you so much for that please leave a like if you did and check out the links in the description and I'll catch you next time bye